With less than two weeks to go, there's a late contender for this year's Christmas number one. Mark and Roxanne Hoyle, better known as the YouTubing duo Lad Baby, are aiming once again for the festive top spot and have brought in help from the money-saving expert Martin Lewis. Our entertainment reporter, Daniel Rosney, has more. For the fifth year, they're back. Over the last four years, thanks to all of your amazing support, we've been able to do something truly phenomenal. With not one, or two, or three, come and sing and dance to sausage rolls. But four Christmas number ones. Profits from the duo's charity single will be donated to the food bank charity, the Trussell Trust, saying they had to do something when people are struggling more than ever. Funds will also be split with the Band-Aid Foundation because they're releasing a version of this 1984 classic. Bob said that he was excited to see what we was gonna do. And like the original, there'll be some celebrities involved this time around. It's top secret for now, other than... Hello. <laughs> the financial Martin expert, Lewis. Martin Lewis. Martin Lewis! I don't think everyone's ready for Martin Lewis's singing voice. I, I, I genuinely don't. It's so good. I mean, in, in the beginning, we had to convince him to start singing, and then by the end of it, we had to convince him to stop. Lad Baby could trump the Beatles to have the most Christmas number ones, but they've got tough competition from Mariah Carey. I've beaten Mariah Carey before. Come on, we can beat Mariah Carey. Daniel Rosny, BBC News. Mariah Carey likes a sausage roll, apparently. Anyway, time for a look at the weather. <laughs> I did just make that up. Uh, here's Matt Taylor. <laughs> she likes a bit of snow as well, looking at that yeah. video. Very good afternoon to you.